Hi guys, I'm Ray from Bake with Ray. Welcome to the Ramadan series. I'll be uploading recipes for Ramadan for the next 30 days, but don't forget to hit subscribe and the bell icon so you can get a notification for every time that I post a recipe. We all know how that cup of tea hits after your iftari meal and here's how to make Kashmiri pink tea to curb those cravings. We're going to start by making the kava, which is the tea part of this. So start by adding water in a saucepan and adding your green tea to that. Then some cardamom pods, some cinnamon stick and a pinch of salt and some baking soda. Baking soda or bicarbonate of soda, not baking powder, okay? Um, this is what's going to help activate the colour in this. So it's really important to add that baking soda. You can also adjust the spices that you put in here. I added obviously cardamom and cinnamon. You can add star anise or other tea spices if you want to. Then you want to just cook this on a high heat, just regularly aerating it by using a ladle and lifting up the tea and pouring it back in. This is going to help with the colour and the aeration of the tea and give it a lovely, lovely flavour. So whilst that's boiling, we can go ahead and prepare our ice water. Now, we need ice water to give this tea a shock therapy, which is also going to enhance the colour. So for that, you want to add a bunch of ice to a jug or something and add some cold water to it. And then just let that set aside while your tea is boiling so that the water gets nice and cold with that ice in. So just continuously boil the tea. It's going to take about maybe 10 to 15 minutes. For the water to reduce in half, you want to be left with like a cup of water at the end. As you can see, the bubbles start going pink. You can see that the color is coming through of this tea. Now we're left with one cup of water. It's reduced down to one cup. You can go ahead and shock this with the cold ice water. Add those two cups of ice water in. If some of the ice falls in as well, that's absolutely fine. Don't worry about that as well. And just add all that water in and you can see instantly how rich the color gets okay but it is a bit diluted because it's still very watery so we want to again cook this down so cooking this down is going to take another 15 to 20 minutes now it's an easy thing to do but it's just time consuming okay so just be patient with it and just continue to ladle it and aerate it until you're left with about a cup and a half of liquid <clears throat> don't know what happened to my voice there uh, until you're left with about a cup and a half of liquid and then your tea is ready so you just turn this off at this point and strain it into any kind of container uh, ideally you want to put it into a jar that has a lid and you can put it in the fridge for up to a week Okay, it'll keep in the fridge for up to a week and you're left with this delicious red liquid, which then you can turn into pink tea whenever you want to. Okay, so when you're ready to make your pink tea, you add enough milk in your pan according to how much tea you want to make. I made just one cup for the sake of this video. And then add as much of the kava, the, the tea, the pink tea that you prepared earlier, according to how bright you want the colour to be of your tea and how strong you want your tea to be. I just added a splash, a couple of splashes, uh, and that was enough for one cup. I think with the amount of kava that you make, you can make quite a lot of tea, cups of tea. So that's a good thing. Let the milk come to a boil on a high heat and then reduce the heat to a simmer for a couple of minutes. It should be ready once there's kind of like cream forming at the top, like a layer of skin forming at the top. And that is your tea basic ready. Pour it into your favorite glass and then add in as much or as little sugar as you like. I don't normally drink sugar, but I just put it in for the sake of this video. <laughs> Top the tea with some chopped nuts of your preference and there you have it, a delicious cup of Kashmiri pink tea. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Enjoy!